So welcome to all who are gathered here and to those who will watch this live recording. May the Lord bless you and keep you safe. We begin by lighting our candle and this evening we pray for unity and peace amongst all faiths. And we also ask God's blessing on all the brothers and sisters of our community. For those who don't know me, I'm Brother Sean, and I'm a member of the Teo community of St. Francis. We light a light for global peace and interspiritual unity. In the name of our beloved Father, Mother God, who creates life. In the name of the risen Christ, who loves life. In the name of the Spirit who is the fire of life. In the name of Gaia, our beloved Earth Mother, who nurtures the supreme in all life. In the name of all faith traditions and none, for they are the sons and daughters of God. <coughs> Excuse me. Our brothers and sisters, we celebrate our spiritual diversity by honoring the supreme in all life. So we begin now with our prologue for our Sunday evening. We enter the eternal and infinite garden with reverence to the heavenly Father, Mother God, the earthly mother and all the great masters and reverence to the holy, pure and saving teaching and reverence to the brotherhood and sisterhood of the elect. Sunday evening we commune with the angel of creative work saying, the Heavenly Father, Mother, God and I are one. We contemplate bees at work and the creative work of humanity in all spheres of existence. And now for the office of Vespers. O God, come to my aid, O Lord, make haste and help me. Glory be to the Father, Mother, God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our teacher to the Holy Spirit of God, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. And the hymn this evening, Holy God, we praise thy name, Lord of all, we bow before thee. All on earth thy scepter own, all in heaven above adore thee. All on earth thy scepter, sorry, all in heaven above adore thee. Infinite thy vast domain, everlasting is thy reign. Hark the loud celestial hymn, angel choirs above are raising, cherubim and seraphim, in unceasing chorus praising. Fill the heavens with sweet accord, holy, holy, holy Lord. Holy Father, Mother, Holy Son, Holy Spirit, three we name thee, while in essence only one, undivided God we claim thee, and adoring bend the knee while we own the mystery. Spare thy people, Lord, we pray, by a thousand snares surrounded. Keep us without sin today, never let us be confounded. Lo, I put my trust in thee, never, Lord, abandon me. And the first antiphon this evening is Christ. The Lord is a priest forever, a priest like the order of Melchizedek of old. And now we read Psalm 109. The Lord's revelation to my master sit on my right. Your foes I will put beneath your feet. The Lord will yield from Zion your scepter of power, rule in the midst of all your foes, a prince from the day of your birth on the holy mountain. From the womb before the dawn I begot you. The Lord has sworn an oath he will not change. You are a priest forever, a priest like Melchizedek of old. The master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his wrath. He shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. And now we pray the glory together. Glory be to the Father, Mother God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Teacher, to the Holy Spirit of God, as it was in the beginning, is now, 
and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Christ the Lord is a priest forever, according to the order of Melchizedek of old. Alleluia. And the second antiphon, Our God is in heaven. He has power to do whatever he wishes. Alleluia. And now we read Psalm 113. Not to us, O Lord, not to us, but to your name give the glory for the sake of your love and your truth. Lest the heathen say, Where is their God? But our God is in the heavens. He does whatever he wills. Their idols are silver and gold, the work of human hands. They have mouths, but they cannot speak. They have eyes, but they cannot see. They have ears, but they cannot hear. They have nostrils, but they cannot smell. With their hands they cannot feel, with their feet they cannot walk. No sound comes from their throats. Their makers will be, come to be like them, and so will all who trust in them. Sons of Israel trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. Sons of Aaron trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. You who fear him, trust in the Lord. He is their help and their shield. He remembers us and he will bless us. He remembers us and he will bless us. He will bless the sons of Israel. He will bless the sons of Aaron. The Lord will bless those who fear him, the little no less than the great. To you may the Lord grant increase to you and all your children. May you be blessed by the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. The heavens belong to the Lord, but the earth he has given to men. The dead shall not praise the Lord, nor those who go down into the silence. But we who live bless the Lord now and forever. Amen. Let us pray the Gloria together. Glory be to the Father, Mother God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Teacher, to the Holy Spirit of God, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our God is in heaven. He has power to do whatever he wills. Alleluia. And now we read a canticle from the book of Revelation. Alleluia! Salvation and glory and power belong to our God. His judgments are true and just. Alleluia! Alleluia! Praise our God, all you his servants, you who fear him small and great. Alleluia! Alleluia! The Lord our God, the Almighty, reigns. Let us rejoice and exult and give him the glory. Alleluia. Alleluia. The marriage of the Lamb has come and his bride has made herself ready. Alleluia. Let us pray the glory. Glory be to the Father, Mother God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our teacher, to the Holy Spirit of God, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Praise God, all you his servants, both great and small. Alleluia. And now we have a short reading for Sunday evening Vespers. And it's from 2 Thessalonians. We feel that we must be continually thanking God for you, brothers and sisters whom the Lord loves. Because God chose you as the first fruits to be saved by the sanctifying Spirit and by faith in the truth. Through the good news that we brought, He called you to this so that you should share the glory of our Lord Jesus the Cosmic Christ. This is the Word of God. Thanks be to God. And the short responsory, great is our Lord, great is his might, great is our Lord, great is his might. His wisdom can never be measured, great is our Lord, great is his might. 
Glory be to the Father, Mother God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Teacher, to the Holy Spirit of God, great is our Lord, great is his mind. And the antiphon for the Sunday of the 13th week of the year is, Master, what is the greatest commandment in the law? And Jesus said to him, You must love the Lord your God with all your heart. Alleluia. And now I invite you to join me for the canticle, the Magnificat. My soul magnifies the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God who is my Savior. He looks on his servant in her lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty has worked marvels for me and holy is his name. His mercy is from age to age on those who fear him. He protects Israel, his servant, remembering his covenant, the covenant made to our fathers Abraham and his sons forever. Let us pray the Gloria. Glory be to the Father, Mother God, to the Lord Jesus Christ, our Teacher, to the Holy Spirit of God, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Master, what is the greatest commandment in the law? And Jesus said to him, You must love the Lord your God with all your heart. Alleluia. And now we come to our evening intercessions, and here we invite you to share any requests on your heart. Through the Gospel, the Lord Jesus calls us to share in his glory. Let us make our prayer with him to our Heavenly Father, Mother God. Response. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for all nations that they may seek the way that leads to peace that human rights and freedom may be everywhere respected and that the world's resources may be generously shared. Response, Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for the church, that her leaders may be faithful ministers of your word, that all her members may be strong in faith and hope and that you may be recognized in the love she bears to all. Response, Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for our families and the community in which we live, that we may find you in them. Response, Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for the faithful departed, that through your mercy they may rest in peace. Response, Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. <clears throat> this evening we pray for the brothers and sisters of the Teo community of St. Francis. We pray for the members of Heart to Soul Prayer Partners for Peace. We pray this evening for Egypt, for all the problems that are there. We pray for Sister Sue's intention, James, to overcome. Okay, we pray for James' special intention and his problems. We pray for all those who are hurting tonight, for those who've given up hope, for those who may be suicidal, for those whose lives are blighted by depression and terminal illness. We pray for all religions that they will come to one table and celebrate the love of one God. We pray for prisoners. We pray especially for our emergency services and we pray for the awful tragedy of the derailment of a train carrying oil or petrol in um, Quebec in Canada. What an awful disaster and also in California for the plane crash there at San Francisco. So we pray for all those who need prayer this evening. Yes, we pray for unity and unity of all faiths, that Sister Sue's request. And I pray this evening for the elderly, the lonely, the vulnerable, 
I pray for those who need prayer but are too proud to ask for help. So as we bring all our intentions together, let us just for a moment be still in the presence of God. Let him speak to our heart. And of course we pray for all our pets, especially in this heat wave. And now we pray the Lord's Prayer, our Father, Mother, God, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give to us tonight our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Let us pray. And the closing prayer this evening. God and Father, Mother, to those who go astray, you reveal the light of your truth and enable them to return to the right path. Grant that all who have received the grace of baptism may strive to be worthy of their Christian calling and reject everything opposed to it. We make our prayer through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. And now we come to the final blessing. The blessing of heaven, the blessing of earth, the blessings of sea and sky, be on those we love this night and on every human family the gift of heaven the gift of earth the gift of sea and sky the gift from brother sun and sister moon be in your hearts now and forevermore amen thank you for joining me for evening vespers have a beautiful evening a restful evening and i look forward to your company again Good night and God bless you all.